honest, how many hours have you spent in lockdown playing games like PUBG or Fortnite or even basic games like Among Us, House Party or even Ludo game? More hours than you can actually count, right? When we think of an engaging way to pass time, gaming is one of the best options people resort to, especially in this stay at home era. Video gaming has become essential, just like TV connection and Netflix subscription, right? The industry is growing at an accelerating pace year after year and it needs skill developers now more than ever. And video game development is an exciting career to have. You get to build worlds of fantasy, action, skill and fun. The worlds of strategy, engineering, computer science, graphics, animation, art all combined together into one video game that is then played by millions all over the world. And this is an industry which is not just interesting to enter but it is also quite lucrative. In 2019, the gaming industry generated total revenue of $151.9 billion. As a developer, it is essential for you to learn game development languages that are the gold standard in the industry that will help you catch employers and game development companies. So in today's video, I'm going to tell you which are the best programming languages for game development. Hi, I am Tanyan and welcome to Inside AML. Number one is C++. C++ is known to be one of the most difficult languages to learn, but it is an important language for game developers. It allows more direct control over variables like the hardware and graphical processes, meaning how fast, snappy and nice the games are, all things which the industry requires. What's more is that it also gives a lot of control over various parameters such as user experience and memory management of the game, important specs that gamers look for. And number two is Java, a coding language with lots of dynamic applications, Java continues to be hugely popular. Java is in demand which makes it a good programming language to learn if you are planning to build your career from the scratch. It is also closely related to C++, so learning both of them together is not a bad idea either if you are planning to expand your skill set. Java is also said to be a good bet for making Android games if mobile gaming is a specific industry you are looking to enter. And number three is HTML5. HTML5 has become one of the most common programming languages for the web. A vast majority of mobile games that you play today utilize this HTML5 as it is easy to create a sophisticated web-based game with a collaboration with JavaScript. The language is easy to learn and does not necessarily require complex programming knowledge of algorithms to learn and that is why it is becoming popular among game developers. Number 4 is JavaScript. JavaScript is often used for interactive online games with JavaScript. It is easier to integrate the codes with conventional web technologies like HTML and CSS leading to an increasing number of cross-platform mobile games. Number 5 is Lua. Lua has a simple language structure and syntax and is becoming one of the quickly adopted languages in the industry. It is a language that can give a game the edge to be on multiple platforms. A vast number of modern games engines utilize Lua as a primary game design programming language. Number 6 is Python. Python is one of the easiest one to use and most versatile programming language used by game developers. It has Pygame framework which lets programmers prototype their game at a fast pace. Number 7 is SQL. SQL usage in games is really dependent on the project you are working on. It is ideally recommended for multiplayer games and not necessary for single player games. Usually, it is used to store player and world related data in multiplayer games. And number 8 is C Sharp. C Sharp is last on the list, but it is definitely one of the most commonly languages used by game developers. It has something called as XNA Framework. XNA Framework is basically a set of tools and runtime environment by Microsoft, which makes it particularly suitable for games on the Xbox or Windows. Monogame is a free and open source C Sharp framework used by game developers to make games for multiple platforms. Of course, these eight are the most popular ones in the industry, but these are not the only ones. Other languages like Rust and Unreal Script are also there in the industry. If you learn and become an expert in any of these programming languages, 
your career in game development is going up the ladder. But honing your skills, becoming not only an expert but efficient is what is needed in this fast-paced industry. The gaming industry is a taxing but a rewarding place to be so if you have an interest in coding and development then it is a good option to try your hands on. Thank you so much for watching. Do stay tuned to watch more videos on AI, machine learning and artificial intelligence. Also don't forget to check our website insideairmail.com which is India's most advanced AI community. I'll see you soon.